G'day everyone, Jumbucker Workers here, and today, Clane's Lay the Spire with brand new mod, Axe, from Dota 2. Now, I've got no clue how the hell are you going to turn a MOBA hero into a bloody turn-based card game. Um, let's go, everyone else has one health, we get Blade Mail which reflects damage, we get Spin. When receiving attack damage, deal damage equal to spin to all enemies. Okay, so every time I get hit, I deal 2 damage to everyone else. That makes sense. Let's head up this way. We've got those two bastards. Ooh. Berserker's... wait, let's go. Defend, defend, and then Berserker's call. And yes, even if I'm blocking, it deals the damage, so this is ridiculously powerful. Shiva's Guard, 11 block, apply 1 weak. Award, 5 block and 3 bloodlust. Hmm. Bloodlust creatures lose health at the start of their turn, but it's reduced by a third when the creature deals unblocked damage, so it's only unblocked. Ooh, this seems pretty good, but what's sadistic? Whenever you apply a debuff to an enemy, they take damage. Oh, and I'm guessing it's equal to the amount of sadistic. All enemies lose 3 strength this turn. Let's go for the Observer Ward. Then here, I will take the money. And now I will spend some of that money to get rid of doubt. And what else can we take? Babysit the carry. Oh my god, that's a bloody fantastic void. Um, tank, Roshan, Tower Dive, Outplayed, support the team. Beam block equal to the damage equal to the cards in your hand. Um, deal 12 damage, the enemy instantly attacks you for 4 damage if it survives. Upgrade a card in your hand for the rest of combat. And that's a level 1 card, that is ridiculously strong. Apply 7 bloodlust, exhaust any number of cards, gain 2 block for each card exhaust. Draw two times cards, discard these cards except for those tied with the highest cost, gain energy equal to that cost, exhaust. Or increase the number of cards you can hold by two. <sighs> nah, definitely gonna tank Roshan. And I could babysit the carry if I want. Ooh, what do I want to build? I'm actually not sure. Nah, I'm gonna leave and probably keep spinning. Um, continue here. I can take the receive. No, thank you. I'll head out this way. Say hi there. Ooh, they got a cloak of flames. When you are attacked, apply one bloodlust to all enemies. Cool, but apart from that, gain 11 block and 2 spin. When retained, gain 2 block exactly. On exhaust, gain that plus an additional 3 block. Worth it. Deal... 9 damage, apply 1 weak, gain 1 weak, no. Do 9 damage, you can exhaust 1 card, hmm. I think I'm fine with just holding off. And insta-killing you. Unfortunate, mate. Oh uh, well, we'll take that, and a bracelet. No longer any... Um, bloody encounters in those question mark zones. First time you lose health each turn, gain 2 spin and apply 2 weak to all enemies. That is ridiculous. Apart from that, initiate, retain, deal 16 damage, you can exhaust 1 card. Nope. So there does seem to be like an exhaust um, build that you can go with. I'm not too sure about that. Uh, let's just cut you two bastards down. We'll take that, attack potion, and ooh, blast rig. When retain, gain 3 vigor. Nah. I think I'm gonna hold off. But now, I'll head out this way and start upgrading cards. You, are you an 8? No, you get extra things. That deals extra damage slightly. More block, more bloodlust. Gain more block. You know what? 12 block for 1 cost. That's pretty good no matter what. We head out here. Take the gold, take the boot. Thank you very much. We'll go here, here for another smith. You know what, we'll take the Aghanim Shard. It's not an 8, but oh well. Instead we get, ooh, cultists. 
um, observer ward, and then stabby stab with the axe, and now, ooh, I'm gonna go berserker's call, then tank Roshan, and I want to upgrade my battle hunger another seven bloodlust so he's gonna take 10 damage this turn cool and i can just end now and he dies or oh, roshan thank you very much tunnel vision deal 21 damage but end your turn or apply bloodlust x amount of times hmm gain five block draw one card and gain one spin you know, I think I'll just take Tunnel Vision. If I can bloody kill someone with that, it's pretty worth. Ooh, okay. Hmm. Does this... Yes, it only targets one, so... I'll have you attack me since you're the weakest. Then another block. And then another block. Everyone's taking damage. And now... Almost all of them are dead. Very, very nice. Now all of them are dead. Even nicer. Come to Axe, the enemy instantly attacks you for one damage. Apply one vulnerable. Apply two bloodlust for each card in your hand. Aim dexterity equal to half the current cards in your hand. That actually seems like it would be kind of ridiculous. However... Ooh. I'll go come to Axe. I would just want to go crazy on the damage. For now at least. I'll stop by, see what you do. You 11 damage, you're fatal, start each combat with one more spin. Ooh, that could be nice. Apart from that, deal two damage to all enemies three times. Gain X, sorry, gain eight block, gain X. Hmm. Or I could take a happy flower. Hmm. Ooh, or I could make a power innate. Which I could use with... Agadim Shard. Do I want that or do I want Happy Flower? Or do I want Good Kind Look? You know what? I'll take this. I just get a shit ton of extra spin as long as I play smart with it. Ooh, okay. And I get Agadim Shard anyway. If I can use that. And then... You know what? Yeah, tunnel vision on you. Getting dazed, which is kind of unfortunate. Let's see. I got a pair of blocks at least. I can punch you in the face and end my turn. I just want to get using lethal range, which your attacks will do. And damn it. Good kind look is still down. Okay. I'm going to axe for you. Oh shit, um, that killed you. Okay, it's fine. I will then just, I guess, hit you. And then end. That's fine. Kill you with the exhaust, and then... I should have bloody targeted you with the kill. Yes, okay. It's fine. They're all dead anyway. Take all of that. Ooh, I can go for a sentry ward. Scrying and removing cards or deal one damage. Deal bonus damage equal to the cards in your hand. Gain spin for every two cards in your hand. No, so they do also just have a bloody infinite cards build, it looks like. Just keep on drawing, keep on stacking. Um, good kind. Look, 14 damage and that's it. Oh well. Now Hex the Ghost. Will we be lucky enough to try and actually get this duck on you? Let's throw all the bloodlust on. Okay, cool. Um, block, block, block. Is he going to get hit for every attack? Yes. Ooh, that's nasty. Uh, let's just go. Berserker's Call. Then Tank Roshan. And I want to just upgrade a strike. And we'll call it there. 
Hmm. Here, come to Axe. Get you weakened. Into a Berserker's Call. Into a Strike. Into a Defend. I'm going to keep that and just have it in the background. If it just so happens to show up when we need it, then I will gladly use it. Um, to put Defend. Tank Roshan. And I want to upgrade this Defend. I get extra block. Which isn't needed right now, but if I need it in the future, that'll be kind of useful. Uh, I can use Battle Hunger or... Yep. Battle Hunger for sure. And Tunnel Vision. Very, very cool. I got 12 spin now. That is actually kind of ridiculous. Let's go Berserker's Call. Then a Defend. Then a Tank Roshan. And... Good kind look. Came exactly when we needed it. Wonderful work there. Ooh, Dagon. 10 damage, deal bonus damage equal to the enemy's bloodlust. Or I can exhaust a card, or... Ethereal, whenever you gain a non-intangible buff, gain one extra stack of it. Ooh. I think I'm gonna skip that though. Yeah, I don't want any of them. Rapier, oh my god, what's this gonna do? Gain energy at the start of each turn. Dark combats with three unplayable retaining curses added to your opening hand. Oh. I thought it was going to be far more powerful than that. You can no longer rest at rest sites or transform three cards. That's kind of disappointing. Um, You know what? I think I'll take Coffee Drinker. I've got enough defense. I don't think I really need to rest. Plus, I got the fairy in a bottle if I ever get into serious trouble. Um, though I will go for a slightly easier path, I think. You know, just in case. Um, I'll use come to axe to at least get rid of a bit of that. Um, then defend. Tank Roshan. And upgrade tunnel vision. 28 damage. Nice! Actually broke through the thing. Um, I defend. Observer Ward. Uh, now nah, I'm just gonna punch you in the face twice. Oh shit! And I could have actually given you thing. Okay. Um, that's fine though. Berserker's Call. Start off with. Then the strike. And look at that! He's dead. Um, what do I want to go for now? Retain, Burner Shadows, deal 4 damage when you play another card with this in hand, increase this card's damage by 1 this combat. Okay, so just for every card I play, this goes up in damage by 1, not terrible. Um, deal 1 damage, deal bonus damage equal to the number of cards in your hand, gain 11 block and 2 spin. Nope, I'm gonna go for Earn. Shit, now I got the Avocado. Um... Get weakened. Then I want to go Berserker's Call. Then a regular defend. Then a battle longer. Then a punch you in the face. Cool. Vulnerable's worn off, but that's fine. Um, um, um. Strike one. Strike two. Then tunnel vision. Nasty bit of damage there. Okay, I could go for the Ag Shard, but I don't think I need to. I'll block twice. Uh, yep, then I'll just strike and go for the Observer Ward. He's gonna slowly die anyway. Oh, actually, forget slowly dying. Die to that. Thank you. Could go for another tunnel vision, could go for another come to axe. I think I'll go come to axe. Oh shit, Sneko. Alright, I'll put on the Aghanim Shard. I'll throw up the call. And then defend, stab. <laughs> defend, but it doesn't matter. It's bloody nunchucks. Should have paid attention to that. Oh well. Oh shit. Um. Well, I can stab you twice. And then tank Roshan. 
And if I do that, it deals 10 damage. Oh, so just an extra 3 damage, I guess. Or that, which deals extra damage. I'll do that. Ooh. Um, um, um. I'll go for a defend. If I play that, then that's the only other thing I can play. And... No, I'll go for a defend. Um, ooh, that's actually kind of nice. A strike. Another strike. Roshan. And, you know what, this time I'll go for the urn. Hmm. Uh, I'll go for the Observer Ward, I guess. Doesn't matter too much. Hey, good kind look. And we get another kill with it. Ooh, Blood Thorn. 7 damage. When target deals unblocked damage to gain 3 Bloodlust instead of losing any. Oh shit, so yeah, Bloodlust build could be broken with that. Um, Juke gains three block, next turn gain one less. Or trade blows, nine damage to each enemy that intends to attack. Hmm. Do I have enough blood loss to make it like a viable build? Oh, uh, you know what, sure. Why the hell not? Ooh. Okay, you know how I said why the hell not? Let's give that back to them and see what they give me they give me a full heal okay i'm happy with that Ooh, bloodstone in one max health at the end of combat lose one max health every time a non-minion dies without blood loss applied okay that's kind of you know that's scary whenever you obtain a curse up your max health at the start of each combat draw two additional cards Hmm, do I have another shop coming up? Um, doesn't look like it unless I go through that path, but then I'm missing out on a campfire. Uh, do I want another upgrade or do I want a shop? I think I want another upgrade, even though the upgrades don't seem too great. I'll just hold on to that for the next bloody thing. I'll take the ags and berserkers call on... You, you hit me, so you both get hit back. Block, block, just to bump up my urn. Plus my nunchucks. Um, let's see now. Another block. I'll tank Roshan on you. And I'll upgrade my urn of shadows. Oh, uh, you know what? I will just kill you and focus on getting my other card for you. What's it called? Yeah, good kind look. I'll hit you with that when it's important, so I'll just hit that, and then stab, stab, stab. You deal 18 damage, and then 14. Oh shit, I fucked up my maths a little bit. Um, 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 zip. Fuck, I fucked up my maths a lot. Okay, so I'm missing out on one there. That sucks. Ooh, item re when retained, also conserve up to one unspent energy on exhaust. Gain one energy and one unspent energy is conserved this turn. Okay, I'm gonna hold off on that because I don't have anything to retain, I'm pretty sure. Uh, we'll go tunnel vision. Okay, proceed onwards. And, ooh. Either we get decay or we gain five max health. I think I'll do that. Since I cannot heal in the future, it's probably worth, I think. Um, no, we'll go for this chest, and we get Lantern. Start coming up with an additional energy. Very, very nice. Ooh, for that, I can get rid of something. What do I no longer need? I kind of want to get rid of a strike. Because I don't need to be hitting, I just need them to be hitting me after I bloody build up my defense okay come to axe you because you got the most amount of health then I guess stab you a bit block block 
tunnel vision. Oh shit, that'll be 42 damage on you. Yeah, that's definitely good enough. Okay now, so come to axe. A block, nope. We'll go for an observer ward. It's still only 14 up to 21 on you. And that's six. No, not enough. I'll hit that. Um, and yeah, end my turn. Oh, well. Ooh, defend Berserker's Call on you. And... I think I will kill you. Yeah. I'm not going to get anything else from this fight. Unless... Ooh, sick luck. Good kind look. Sorry, good kind look. Reaction time. When you attack, draw one card. Okay, that can actually be kind of ridiculous. Let's fucking go with it. Can I smith it into anything really good? One cost. I'm happy with that. Okay. We got the snake plant coming in. Um, Come to axe. Throw up a block. A ward. Stab. And then another stab. Gonna deal 21 damage. Kinda sad. Oh well. Ooh, axe shard. Berserker's full. And then tunnel vision is lethal. Very, very good. Ooh, wink dagger. Had a daze to your hand, but apply a vulnerable, apply a bloodlust, and draw a card for free. Ooh. No, I'm gonna skip over it. Don't want to use the bunch and get a shit ton of dazed um, running through my deck. Oh, I can't have it. Strike you. Get some block. Strike you. Defend and end. Very, very cool. Ooh, reaction time. Then come to axe on you. Yes, Berserk is cool. Um, tank Roshan on you. Just to up earn a shadows. And I'll go battle hunger. Let it go. Then just bump up my defense a bit. Come to axe just to again keep earn a shadows going up. Oh shit. Okay. Um damn, nothing else. Berserker's call. Wait for that. Because I need good kind again. There we go. Thank you. How much spin am I actually starting off with now? Ooh, if the enemy intends to attack, deal 12 damage. Or retain, deal 20 damage. You may exhaust one card in your hand. You know what? I think I'll take that just because it retains. It seems pretty decent. Um, um, um. Pink Roshan, you can deal more damage. Since you can't upgrade yourself. Now, I can't heal myself, but I do have a fairy in a bottle if I need it. Um, in the meantime, though, Berserker's Call. Then come to Axe. Then punch you in the face, punch you in the face. And then block, and then, I don't know, drink the attack potion just for shits and giggles. Culling Blade, deal 5 damage, then inst sorry, instantly kill the enemy if they have 20 health or left. And if you do, refresh it. I can't really do that. I can use Blood Thorn and just... Yeah, you know what? Just stuff it. Or deal 3 damage, equal bonus to the... Oh no. Double your spin, so this is going to be way more. That's actually something I should probably look into trying to see if I can't get on my own. Still, um, Agadem Shard. Blood Lust. Come to Axe. Just get some of that down. Then defend. End my turn. He's going to take good time, which is fine. Oh shit, I almost died there. Okay, um... Defend. Deserve a ward. Don't want to initiate on him. Hmm... Now, I'll go for Tank Roshan. And upgrade the urn. Good, good, good. This is all fine. Um... 
deal 20 damage there, which... No, I need to go for some defense. Undefend there. Reaction timer, I guess. And then 28 damage. End my turn. Okay, he's going all in on the defensive, so let's go Berserker's Call. Then, come to Axe. Battle Hunger. Another come to Axe. Ooh, do I want to go for an Observer Ward, or... Do I want to go Initiate? That's 30 damage, yep. Ooh, or I could still go, yeah. Observer Ward, and then a regular strike. End my turn there. Then I can initiate and earn a Shadows next turn if I need to. Ooh, overextend for 33, up to 49 damage. Thank you very much. Oh, and yeah, Tunnel Vision will kill. Easy. And a go game was through. Hey, on disc, when you lose HP, exhaust this card. On exhaust, gain one buffer. Gain eight block. Exhaust one card in your draw pile. Or literally no damage. <laughs> All enemies lose 99 strength this turn. Gain four spin. Exhaust. Uh, I... Mm. Hey on disc. Mechanism. Or literally no damage. Let's go no damage. <laughs> My god, that seems ridiculous. And we start with an extra thing, potions, remove two cards. Let's give him some strength, I'm not a coward. What type of axe player would I be if I'm a coward? Let's head over this way. Oh, dark wings, okay. Got a life link, you bastards. Um, short come to axe. Then I'll also drop a defend, and then stab you, stab you, stab you. You've all been stabbed equally. Okay, I'll go for a block, come to axe, hit use all again, and observe a ward. Um, I don't really know, battle longer to you maybe, and then initiate on, do I want to kill one of them? Damn it, I can't actually kill any of them. Best I can do is that, which will knock you out before you try and hit me, and then you hit twice, which kills everyone, cool. You still dealt a lot of damage to me though, which is kind of sad. Um, I think I might be regretting not being able to heal. You there, do you have anything that could help me? Fruit juice? Um, apart from that, question card, anchor maybe? Hmm. I will take babysit the carry, that could actually be kind of nice. Um, ooh, I'll get rid of the fear potion for the fruit juice. Hmm. Proceed onwards. Got to deal with you three bastards. Okay. Aghanim Shard. Into a Berserker's Call by you. Into a regular strike. Battle Hunger on you. And then, do I want to hit you for eight? Nah. Just gonna wait. Do I have thingy? No, I don't. Okay. Um, you, come to Axe. Ooh, then defend, tank Roshan, and I'll upgrade babysit the carry. Let that go through the deck, because I want good kind. Um, I'll go reaction time, uh, and then observer ward. Yeah, end of that. He dies, he hits, and he's dead anyway. Oh well, um, reposition, gain 7 block, next turn gain energy, and draw an additional card. Sure thing. Up here though, I'm falling down and I need to lose something. I will lose maybe battle hunger. Yep, I'll lose the battle hunger. Shit, I can either go left or right. Which side has merchants on it? Um, neither actually. Okay, I think I'll go far left here instead then. Oh, got them all. Okay, Aghanim Shard. Come to Axe. 
regular strike. Throw the blocks up to get Nunchaku up to 9. And here we go. Okay, Berserkers call on you. And you have strike, strike. Do I just want to use... Yeah, you know what? I will just hit you anyway, because I got three weakened. It's kind of bad. Fruit juice. Drink that shit. I completely forgot about it. Um, let's go. Hmm. Gain block and deal damage equal to your cards in hand. Oh shit, I thought it was saying that I get to deal damage equal to the total in hand, not actual number of cards. Yeah, that's actually kind of terrible. I'll use that at the very least and go... Actually, what's literally no damage upgraded? Ooh, six spin. I'm not going to use that yet, though. We'll go babysit the carry. Lock, I guess, and initiate. I don't want to exhaust anything, so we'll wait that out. Okay. Um, reaction time. Then come to axe. Got tunnel vision. Okay. Reposition to start off with. Tank Roshan. Upgrading my strike. Now, do I want to go strike and observe a ward? Or do I just want to go tunnel vision for 21 to 31 damage? That's probably the right bet. Oh shit. Okay. Damn it. No point in even going for literally no damage, but hey. Berserk is cool. Um, reposition. A strike. Um, tank Roshan, I guess. Up the Urn of Shadows, which will deal 14 damage. Which is lethal. Thank you very much, even without it. It's Mogul time. Innate, whenever an attack deals unblocked damage, apply one bloodlust. Nope. Skip, and we'll head off this way. Just keep upgrading everything. Um, come to Axe. Now it does two vulnerable. Very cool. Got you bastards to deal with now. So, block. Um, you come to Axe. Then Berserker's Call. Then, I don't know, who will tank Roshan? You, probably. Then another come to Axe, or another two vulnerable. And you're the only one left alive. How unfortunate. Um, defend. Stab you. Very, very good. Weak potion. Um, skip that. Keep running. Can I win this final boss with only 40 health? Oh, it's not looking good, I'll be honest. Hmm. Let's see. Tori, when you've received 5 or less unblocked attack damage, reduce it to 1. That's actually solid. Very, very nice. So we got Rithering Mass. Let's go for a defend to start off with. Reaction time. A strike. An innate. And, you know what? I'll still... End my turn there. Okay. I will take literally no damage. Thank you. Then Aghanim Shard. And reposition for next turn. Or do I want to attack him? I think I want to attack him actually. And do that. Cool. Okay. Come to babysit the carry. Then you come to Axe. Then come to Axe again. Then, um, defend. Strike, I guess. Observer Ward. End of my turn. He's only going to deal 12 damage, which is nice. Okay. Come to Axe again. Berserk is called. He's only got 9 health, which is easy to stop. There we go. Um, do skip. Go on to the next. Three of these little bastards I should be able to deal with. Um, Berserkers, call on you. Come to Axe now. Now get repositioned. And then strike, strike. And I don't have anything else to use. Shit. What could I play to deal a bunch of extra damage? Honestly, Berserker's Call. Liquid Memories, Berserker's Call. Bring that up. 
And now I've got enough block to survive this. Big damage there. Nice damage there. Tank Roshan on you. And then Tank Roshan on you. Very good. Everything's all nice and fixed. Hmm. Continue. Skip card. This bastard. Okay. Um, Tank Roshan on him. And go strike to deal extra damage. Very cool. Now, ooh, um, come to axe. Berserker's call. Could go literally no damage right now, which would be kind of fun, but instead reaction time and innate. I'll hold on to it, because I don't want it to exhaust just yet. Observer ward. Cool. A strike. Roshan. Into the urn. Cool. Then, sure, I'll just defend. We've got an E6, that's good. Now, again, come to Axe. Um, maybe sit the carry, I guess, maybe? Uh, yeah, sure. Reposition. A strike, and then tunnel vision. 42 damage thanks to the bloody vulnerable. Yep, that done so much work for me. And literally no damage. Cool. Try me, mate. Take the gold. Take. At the start of your next turn, deal 15 damage to all enemies. For free, or... Or overextend. No, I'll take overextend. Pray to transform a card. Uh, I could get rid of Parasite. Oh no, it would just turn it into a different one. Um, what do I want to transform? Babysit the carry, because that was actually kind of worthless. I fucked up there. And I get to draw extra cards. Cool. Lose all gold to obtain a relic. Red mask, apply one week. Thank you very much. Ah, do 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 do. Literally no damage. Let's get on with it. So, 29 health against this bastard. Does not seem like much chance. Um, uh, let's see. Tank Roshan on you. Let's upgrade that. So, no, that just makes it an 8, so we'll go for a regular strike. Quarter the team. Um, stab you, stab you. And let's end. For fuck's sake, I gotta weaken you. Ah oh, shit. I could also just literally no damage. Well, I wasted that potion. Oh well. Reaction time and an observer ward. Let's go. Everyone's still gonna be beating the shit out of themselves though, which is very, very nice. Come to axe. Berserker's call before I deal more damage to myself. Come to you, me yourself. That, that, that. Um, Roshan. So I can go Urn of Shadows. Then reposition. Regular defend. Regular defend. Very good. Okay, I've got 15 block. God damn. Um, Wait, 15 spins, so 33 damage on you. Actually, that's up to 49. Okay, let's just start off first with a Aghanim Shard. Come to Axe. I'll take the one damage. Now, oh, I'll take another damage for it. Oh shit, it's only the first time, so yeah, I just took extra damage for no reason there. Oh well, 58 damage on you, and then 21 damage on you, sure, strike there. And now that stuff's just garbage. There we go. It's gonna try and beat the ever-loving shit out of me now. Um, five block, five block. Um, what can I get as a skill potion? Literally no damage, thank you. That is an Incredibly good ability there. Um, do I want to play? No. Nah. I'll go for that and then tunnel vision. End my turn there. 
Okay. Oh shit. Berserk is cool. Then tank Roshan. Then tank another Roshan. I can earn of shadows for 30 damage. Overextend for 47, but with just two Oh wait, just for one energy. Then 20 energy for two, so yeah. 30, 50. Close to a hundred, but I'm still way short. I'm gonna go Gambler's Brew. Get rid of Parasite and just my regular strikes. And maybe go for something defensive. Okay, I can just start spamming defense, but that's not really any good. I can go Tunnel Vision for 28 damage instead. I was kind of hoping that I could have gotten... Yeah, come to Axe for some vulnerables. Ah, shit, I don't think I have this. Let me just try, um... Yeah. I'll go... Overextend. 47. Yeah, 31 damage and then 28 would be the most amount I can deal. Ah, oh, that sucks. We actually came ridiculously close there. Ah, oh, would the weekend have actually done it? I think it might have actually. God damn, just pulled up short. Ah, <sighs> oh well. Much like a normal axe in Dota, I ended up killing myself. What a shame. Thank you.